So we want to make uh, maybe it's remission uh, a reality. This is the take home message in case I didn't finish my lecture. So I'm, I want to be sure that this is the uh, message I will to deliver to everybody. So at the end of this session, I hope that most of us at least will be convinced that this remission is that. It is practical and achievable. Uh, in yeah. our conference yesterday, three of uh, four or, of our eminent professors touched this subject. Uh, Professor Hanan talked about uh, genome studies and this kind of thing, and the, the uh, classification of diabetes and how the genome can help with prevention, management, and prediction of the complications. Uh, so, uh, talking about prevention and better understanding of the diabetes. Professor Peter talked about pathophysiology, which is the base for understanding the mechanism of diabetes development so that we can uh, combat it in a right way. Uh, professor and our godfather, Professor Morsi Arab, uh, talked about the uh, basic ideas about energy balance and this kind of thing. And Professor Adel uh, talked about uh, how early and how strict control. And he talked about uh, that study and the retune study, both studies talking about diabetes remission. So a few years ago, when we want to raise as a subject of diabetes remission, uh, very big percentage of our colleagues say that it is not practical, it is not achievable, and this kind of thing. But now, four years later, three years later, it is very important subject, and it was First was uh, mentioned, First mentioned in about global this, the report of the WHO, WHO in uh, 2016. In 19, there was a paragraph about reversal of diabetes. Very low calorie diet can lead to the reduction of Very symptoms low or to calorie diet the reversal can lead to the reduction of well. symptoms or to the reversal of hyperglycemia typical of type 2 diabetes was mentioned the reversal may of be hyperglycemia so long as weight typical of type 2 diabetes gained. the reversal may be maintained so long as weight is not regained then the diabetes uk if you go to the website of the then, uk you will find a very important the, topic uh, which is called diabetes with many details website, you will find uh, the subject is not uh, only uh, between uh, association this kind of thing but it is for practitioners and this, this is an update for practitioners uh, is not published only 2022 to be, uh, to be discussed not only the, that uh, but this is another paper again, the mission of the two diabetes position statement uh, from <clears throat> The title Association said, of British Remission of Type 2 Clinical Diabetes and the Primary Care Society. Society. So, and from the, the clinical point of view, so and the, the primary care doctors should be aware of this topic, which is very important in because in what we are going to To be sure uh, that we have uh, consensus about the definition of the uh, remission, in uh, that it is uh, absence of hemoglobin C is below 6.5 for six months without any. Uh, anti for what, is beyond what is the logic beyond the logic beyond this is a graph uh, from in this graph we find 1997 to 2015 this is 18 years uh, period the and number and the uh, instance of the risk increased for by three folds Again, in and, uh, many trials with the control of diabetes, again, and as we can see, it is uh, of usually the, uh, progressive because there is diabetes, we will find uh, that type two uh, is a progressive uh, disease. This is what they used to say. Again, uh, here there is no control, uh, and again, this is a progressive because disease. Because he said that it is here in uh, America and the United States, at least two thirds of the type uh, of diabetics <laughs> are not well. Uh, the AIDS is not well controlled. Now, the, uh, if, uh, then failure of management or failure of control of diabetes, when they uh, put an idea that we may intensify uh, treatment, control, when they intensify the intensive glycemic control, uh, it has a very good condition and the microvascular uh, complications, but the macrovascular complications the macro -vascular effect, no, 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 no. As no regard the mortality, appreciated. the opposite, regarding the increased mortality, mortality in agro mortality study, increased and we know all that it was eliminated prematurely because of the increased because incidence of increased mortality. Of mortality. <laughs> Here in Again, two cities in Amsterdam, into in this graph Netherlands, that the uh, instance of registration of the new cases of diabetes. Well, down near zero at 1944. This is the World War II. So, if the there's no ample amount of food, there's no diabetes. Uh, so, the relation between food and diabetes is 
very uh, uh, obvious. And now uh, we this, know all the bariatric surgeries, uh, bariatric surgeries, uh, and the remission of type 2 diabetes was achieved of type 2 diabetes, up to 95 percent uh, in one of the diabetes. So it is not a chronic progressive disease; it can be cured and can so be. It is not uh, chronic progressive disease. The patient can went into remission, and not, not cured, and remission. Proof of this. Uh, the then UK the diabetes, uh, UK uh, starts the diet study, study. Diet study, and this study was this study. funded by Diabetes UK, uh, and, by Diabetes UK uh, and sponsored uh, the primary sponsor by the National Health Service, so, so it was no not bias, biased not by any pharmaceutical uh, company or anything like that. By the, the result of this study, the after one month, of two nine months, out of ten uh, participants uh, who lost study, 15 study kilograms or more were in uh, the mission. Nine low calorie out of ten controlled very weak by the percentage. After two, after two years, two thirds of those who lost 10 kilograms or more were in remission. Two thirds of those who were in the biology of remission. Uh, what is the, the biology of remission? The chances the chance of remission of were closely linked, linked, linked to weight loss. To weight nearly loss. nine, nearly nine, nine, again, nine in ten, ten people were in remission, remission if they, if they, they lost 15, lost 15 kilograms or more. Kilograms this significant weight loss this significant weight loss resulted in a drop in fat in both the liver and the as we said before. The Professor drop in the fat uh, of the, the, the liver Charles said improved. yesterday the, the loss of fat uh, from the liver is resistance, resistance, and resistance and the drop and of the fat from the liver improved the, the, the loss of fat beta cell from the improved the beta cell function and as we can see as we can oh, sorry. also oh, we'll come back. Uh, there was a MRR uh, uh, picture showing that the fat in the liver was 36% and after losing 15, 15 kilograms, it became 2%. So the liver uh, lost amount of fat that uh, causes this type of remission. Also, uh, fat removal from the pancreas can restore beta cell function. This is the, uh, obvious on the uh, microscope. Also, now, now we should aim, we believe I that, believe, that we should uh, aim uh, at remission, this remission. Not achievable if not achieved, cases, it's not achievable for everybody, but we will if we get aim other at benefits like losing weight, the general activity, we will get other less benefits, other, less uh, chances uh, of complications. Uh, uh, and we can lose weight by eating, which is by health uh, diet, or activity, by all means, health diet, less diet less medication, exercise, of bariatric surgery if needed, and, and drugs. We can I think that lose in the future we should think enemy, about drugs enemy. to not control the diet, by all means, to by healthy diet, with exercise, by diet, and drugs. So the drug has a role, but not to control, but to help us to make the distribution in the aim. Why is remission important? Remission our important. increasing knowledge of remission knowledge is regarding changing our understanding of diabetes. Of diabetes. Like uh, said, what, uh, what we saw as so lifelong as progressive, lifelong condition, progressive does condition does not have, have to be like this anymore. It's very important. The possibility of achieving remission, remission provides, provides hope, hope for and motivation. Remission, remission, remission can be life changing for those who achieve it. Can be life the opportunity for to those stop taking the obese medication, the need to, to manage the obese taking day to day medication. Lowering hemoglobin uh, one sees can lower the reduction in the benefits and other uh, benefits. Changing the obese completely. We'll touch uh, the here classification why of some uh, type, type patients two, diabetes is not get one of in this or went to end very, into uh, it is at least uh, four or four and more not. subtypes because to the type two is C, not HOMA B, HOMA IR, just uh, one body mass index, index or and one entity. I wonder whether this classification uh, correlates with the genome modalities uh, of the genome types of the insulin deficient. Diabetes, severe insulin, but this different classification and uh, mild this diabetes, explain why some patients are more information and others not. And I wonder whether, whether this classification, which is last but not least, this last is, but not least, this is a study, a study which was done called, uh, from January uh, 2018 to August. It was uh, conducted from January uh, 2018 to August 2022. As uh, 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 Professor Al uh, said, the reversal of type two diabetes upon normalization of energy. It is called a retune study. It is study. The reversal of type 2 diabetes upon normalization of energy intake in non-obese people. Uh, non-obese. Uh, that study, study was done on obese uh, people. Uh, officially uh, after two months or so. This in non, in non so, the distribution can be the budget of this study was more than half a million. Uh, this study aimed at improving that or, 10 million or not. Pound. So, the budget of this study is about how more than one uh, half a million sterling pounds. It's more than 10. Now I will go through. Now I will discuss uh, uh, some sort. Uh, I, I'm, I'm trying to maybe link the dots. To like so that, why that some maneuvers and drugs 
help in the past to when we are concentrating uh, in concentrating in not. the we can we are concentrating on serum the glucose. Body, the the serum should concentrate but on I the think body if we concentrate in the body but glucose we will get better results. Yeah. Uh, what why? decreases sorry uh, how to less decrease in, the body glucose so more out. Less in, in through healthy diet, less in through healthy diet, and more out through exercise and SGLT inhibitors. What increases body glucose and lipids? 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 Consequently, and healthy diet, so more insulin, more glucose, glucose, increase insulin secretion, and if we use insulin, both and lipids, which is the hallmark of the disease of the liver, serum insulin that causes more glucose into the cell with whether we will left side, learn it by exercise, or the, 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 the amount will on be stored side, in glycogen no, or lipogenesis, which so, is a hallmark of let's make the mission so, reality. Shall we make Professor the mission? Professor Christian Bernard said, I have saved the lives of 150 people with heart transplantation. I have saved the lives of 150 people with heart transplantation. If I had focused on preventive medicine earlier, I would have saved 150 million. And this is uh, this slide. Uh, this uh, the recording, recording, can recording of the uh, lecture the, uh, uh, can be uh, lecture on the through scanning this uh, QR.